Hey YouTube, what's up? It's Xandro here, and today I want to talk to you about the EOC and the abilities they have. Um, really what I want to talk about as well is um, Vesta's and Stadius armor and why they don't give strength bonus. Also, all the um, Dragon Claws and why they are not used anymore. Um, reason being, Vesta's and Stadius are completely junk now. The only reason people buy them now is to try to get them under what the... Um, how much money you get back if you were to die with them, you get a GP, like 20% of what it's originally worth, I think, in GP or something like that. So basically all of them are selling for a fourth, unless they are useful, which the only ones I've seen that actually bought over market were non-corrupt Zerials, but I haven't got any non-corrupt Morgans, so I don't know about that. But anyways... Um, what I want to talk to you about is how Jagex could actually fix the EOC and bring back um, the balance of Vestas and Stadius and all the Revenant gear, weapons and armor, and also the God Swords and the Dragon Claws. Now, what they could do, as you can see I'm in the ability bar right here, if they were just to simply add abilities, like, there would be an extra slot here that would show, like, a uh, god sword dragon claws or something that represents um special ability weapons like weapons that only use abilities towards that oh uh, abilities that are only used for a specific weapon such as if there's dragon claws there would be an ability called slice and dice ultimate ability do it does 350 400 percent damage equal to what slice and dice was so it would be like using a special ability still but it would be using a full adrenaline bar instead of special attack bar um maybe some can use threshold because dragon claws were half and half but it could really put in one just to make it a little bit stronger it's just to do an ultimate attack so dragon claws wouldn't be dead i mean why in the fucking hell would you want to kill tormented demons to get dragon claws that are as useless as uh dragon long swords or skimmies or like something like that quest is so hard for to get something as use like one of the most useless dragon weapons like and who buys dragon weapons you buy it for the special attack so they should add like slice and dice or something also for each god sword you would unlock abilities towards that god sword special such as bandus god sword would have a hundred and fifty two hundred percent weapon damage with a certain percentile weakening your opponent's defense like it did zamra god sword freezes your opponent for whatever an ice barrage does now and does 125 to 150 percent damage or something. Um, Ceridoman God Sword um, hits a 150 percent weapon damage while healing a fourth of your prayer and health. Um, and then they'd all be the the special attack name would be the ability names. Um, there's also the like Granite Ball, um, Dark Bow. Well, there's that double shot now, but. For a dark bow, maybe they could just transfer that into a possibly a basic ability to make that double shot. Because it's not that strong, it's just a double shot. Plus, you're going to have to choose to use a dark bow while making a threshold a basic. Or you could be using a stronger bow or a crossbow. Like, all these things could really come in handy. Also, Vesta's Stadius, um, the weapons that have their special attack abilities back as well. And the armor, I think the armor should give critical damage. This is what they need to do. They either need to make it where it gives critical damage, um, have the armor last more than an hour, if the defense is going to be a little more. I mean, nobody's going to, everybody does PVM now. Like, I tried PK yesterday. I died three times, like, instantly. Like, I got comboed out by Rangers, and I lost full rune, which I wasn't a big risk. I didn't really care. It was just like, oh. But I did lose a skill cave, so it was like 200k loss. I'm like, eh, that's pocket change. But, yeah, I can't PK. I'd, I'd really have to do some practice. Um, One of my really good buddies, uh, KillerJMan91. Is it 91? Yeah, my buddy right here. I'll tell him to say hi to YouTube. He's probably, yep. Uh, to YouTube. Um, yeah, he's one of my uh, best friends in this game, I'd say. It's also Ewax, who has a series of uh, Road to Max Cape as well, and other series, Blank to Bank, which is uh, is Ewax on RS, which uh, we were supposed to do a duo thing, but I really stopped playing when he was playing, and I just got back recently. So, um, But 
Vestas, they either, Vestas and Stadius, Morgans and Zerials need to give a critical bonus in which the attack is 2, like Zerials, uh, Magic, Critical, and if not, then it should last up 5, between 5 and 10 hours at least, I mean, it'd be like, um, get Gano in a way, because of that last 10 hours of combat, but it gets completely destroyed, but Vestas and Stadius would be like, um, from a lay gear instead of magic towards um other ones like range against range and uh Gano is mainly for majors with that like high uh melee defense and major defense. Like it's kinda like Zerials but better. Um but they should really do that Vestas and status because there's only a Gano for Mage. But you can also use it with Malay, so it's like a kind of a brid gear. But he need to really either make if Vestas and Stadius were ten hours um, in combat, then um, they w it would make more sense now. If they didn't do any stat change, just made it ten hours of combat, people would actually use them for a PVMing. Um, the price may have may gone up, but if they were to do ten hours, maybe they could do five hours. But if doing so, they could make the rarity of the drops more or whatever. It is still pretty decently tough to get them. And it was an hour in combat for PKing, but um, they really, really nerfed him a bit too hard, I think. That's stupid. They should either give crit advantage. So this is my video to you guys. This is just my opinion on what they should do with the EOC. Um, my last video, I just woke up and one of my buddies said uh, I thought I was high, so no, I wasn't. I was just really tired, so um, yeah, I'm gonna do some pyramid plunder right now. I'm gonna get 80 um, thieving, then I'm gonna get 80 in this, then I have to get 80 in that, 80 in this, 80 in that, which is gonna suck. I don't want to. 80 crafting, 80. <laughs>